We're getting late word tonight on the Boeing 737 MAX. The FAA says it's discovered a new flaw that could further delay its return to the skies. All 737 MAXs were grounded after two crashes overseas that killed 346 people. Chris Van Cleve has the latest. During flight tests in a Boeing 737 MAX simulator in Seattle, FAA test pilots discovered a computer issue that could slow down the pilot's ability to quickly respond to a scenario like the one seen in the two MAX crashes. The issue occurred when the pilots were evaluating failure scenarios where the nose of the plane was being pushed down. The test pilots felt it remained down longer than it should, leaving them concerned it would increase the chances of a crash. Boeing is now working on a software fix to address this issue with a microprocessor in the flight computer. If that fails, the component would have to be replaced on all MAX airplanes, likely extending the global grounding. Boeing CEO oh, Dennis uh, Mullenberg. We will spend time understanding every dimension of these accidents and making every possible improvement we can make as a result. The FAA will not schedule the required airborne test flight of the software update until this issue is resolved. United Airlines today joined American and Southwest in removing the 737 MAX from its flight schedule until at least September 3rd. Maurice? Chris Van Cleve, thank you.